myself Sreen Chandra of class 11 science from Raipur cluster. I am present here with a model on the topic ellipse. So first I want to tell what an ellipse is and how an ellipse is formed. Ellipse is a set of all points present in a plane whose sum of distances from two fixed points is a constant. In other words we can say that if these two are our fixed points then the sum of distances on, on any point on the ellipse is a same or constant. So now when you understand what an ellipse is, I want to tell how an ellipse is formed. So ellipse comes under the conic sections. So I want to understand how conic sections are formed. So this is our cone and this is our x, this is our xy plane and this is our z axis. So if we cut the cone parallel to the xy plane, we get a circle. When we cut the cone with some angle and the figure formed is closed curve, we get an ellipse. When we cut the cone parallel to its round edge, we get a parabola and we cut the cone perpendicular to its xy plane, we get a hyperbola. Now I, I want to demonstrate the terms related to ellipse through our model. As you can see, these are our two foci. The midpoint of the line segment passing through these two foci is our center. And the, this line segment passing through the two foci is called major axis. The line perpendicular to the major axis is our and passing through the center is our minor axis. And lastly the end points of the ellipse of the major axis is called vertices. As you can see in our demonstration. Okay. To make it more enjoyable for the student instead of a striker, we can use a laser light to get a pinpoint precision of this property. So when we lit up the laser light on the F1 position, it will, it will due to the reflecting surfaces present on the inside borders of ellipse, it will get reflected and the reflected ray will pass through the cylinder. So as you, as you can see, yeah. proves that the sum of distances from two fixed points on any point on the ellipse is a constant or same. So as you can see how this model beautifully explains the properties of ellipse to make it more enjoyable for the students and makes learning easier. Also, this model can be used to integrate and find out the area of ellipse. differentiation as every point on ellipse has only one tangent as you can see here it has only one tangent here one tangent here one tangent this property of ellipse can be used in our indian army to attack or target the enemy anonymously if we put the if we can put the army on the one focus of ellipse and on the second focus we can put our Indian army through this property of ellipse we can target our enemy anonymously yet it also has a disadvantage that this model this property if our enemy knows it can be used against us but also we can tackle us by developing a technique or mechanism that its vice versa cannot be done so now uh, these are our models these model can be used to teach students the the properties of ellipse and ellipse very beautifully in a very fun and enjoyable way which makes learning easier, efficient and joyful for the students. So I hope you, uh, you like our model. Thank you.